My friend took this picture on the day I told my husband about getting tired of our boring life. We argued so much that we've been separated since then. Whatever I did, our picnics always ended with my mother in a grumpy mood. That's why I usually made plans with my father instead. <laughs> Everyone at high school was so jealous when they saw this photo. You had to have been very lucky to get to see the famous elephant. Going together with the most popular girl in school didn't help either. Dear Moriko, why did you do that? You were so pretty and smart. <sighs> My eyelids are getting heavy. I hope he lets me sleep tonight. I miss sleeping. Do you see that white thing to the right of the open pit? That thing that looks like a dinosaur fossil. When I was a kid, my dad used to bring me here for some fresh air. The first time we were here, he showed me the white patch of sand and said it used to be a baby dinosaur running from the humans. But it must have been dark, so the baby dinosaur falls into the pit and starves to death. The story made me more scared of the humans on the other side of the pit than of dinosaurs. Maybe that was my dad's intent. He used to say that in those mills and houses on the other side of the pit live humans who turn into animals at night and come and steal things from us. I wish it were those stories that I couldn't remember. Although people on the other side of the pit had left years ago, I never found out who actually lived there. I wish you were here, Dad. We could go to the other side and have a closer look. Hey, hey! Looks like you're falling asleep. Open your eyes. This is only the 17th day of no sleeping. Could you turn your face away? Those terrifying red eyes. Why don't you leave me alone? How long are you going to torture me? I want to leave you alone, but I can't. Since long ago when I was a young captain, I couldn't be awake while sailors were asleep. Come on. Get up, get out of bed. Don't you have a few days off from work? Go play a little at least. Good thing I have a photo of most of my friends. Otherwise, I would forget their faces thanks to my memory problems. Good thing I have a photo of most of my friends. Otherwise, I would forget their faces thanks to my memory problems. These days, they call it sticky notes. I prefer to call them memoranda. This is only half the map. Where's the other half? They say the quality of old vinyl are still better than these new stuff. Thank you.
The last time I tried to open the door, I couldn't remember what code I had chosen. I don't feel like thinking about this right now. Maybe sometime later. Hi, Miso. Nice to see you come and not making noise. Don't worry. Erica will return in a few days and we'll take you back home. Sorry I couldn't spend enough time with you. I know a laptop doesn't fit well in this game, so I'm not gonna waste my time. I know a laptop doesn't fit well in this game, so I'm not gonna waste my time. Alright, now I can put the map pieces back together. The last time I tried to open the door, I couldn't remember what code I had chosen. I don't feel like thinking about this right now. Maybe sometime later. When I was a kid, every time I wanted to go to a classmate's birthday, I would bring one of these. Lately, whenever I lay down, I see a horrifying old man with red eyes by my bed. I prefer not to sleep, so I won't see that creep. My warm, comfy bed. I wish I could sleep on you with peace of mind. I feel a bit nervous to go out without a map. What if I get lost and can't remember my home address? This is only half the map. I feel safer with the map. It's nice to have a drink every once in a while. My old sister's only cut paper now. Hi, Miso. Nice to see you come and not making noise. Don't worry. Erica will return in a few days and we'll take you back home. Sorry I couldn't spend enough time with you. I remember the last movie shown here was The Wood Elves Battle. When I was a child, this Mr. Juggalo was my favorite actor in fantasy movies. What's under the rug?
What a photograph. So this fellow Jack was friends with the elephant in the cirque. Why did Jack close up this place for good? What's even more odd is that none of us ever tried to find out why. Hello? Please don't hang up. Could you tell me what you took the pit to? What? None of my business. What do you mean you'll come back in a while? You didn't think I'd find you, huh? Well, I found your phone number on one of your spaghetti boxes. You'd written it down on the corner and thrown it in the trash. Ever since the elephant vanished, so did you. Are you in some sort of trouble? What? You don't know what I'm talking about. Frankly, I don't trust you anymore. Who trusts the man who prefers his tasteless spaghetti to my pancakes? Don't hang up. Hold on. Hello? Hello? Damn it. <laughs> Hi, little girl. What's your name? I don't think I've ever seen you around here. <laughs> don't want to talk to me? Don't be scared. I live in this building. I can't talk to you because you don't have children. Hi, little girl. What's your name? I don't think I've ever seen you around here. <laughs> Some people get lucky and make it, but I'm not one of them. I prefer to keep it for myself. Even if I knew the lady behind this door, I wouldn't approach her when she is so angry. Me, my dear kidney stone. No living soul can move as much as these kidney stones. Some people get lucky and make it, but I'm not one of them. Kardash has to make up a new system every time to identify who knocks at his door. Doesn't anyone who understands music ever end up here?
Jack is always proud that his son, Arash, followed a path that he was not able to follow. He went to a different continent a few years ago and is working on his second movie now. I totally remember the day Jack put up this poster. I even bought the text myself. Everything in this flat smells old. This clock is always behind, and the calendar on the table is from six years ago. Jack drinks so much coffee and tea that he has to keep the fan on all the time. If you're new, you may try and read this to get the news. Little would you know, this newspaper has been here for weeks. Hey, Jack. Oh, I'm sure he's going to make a remark about my name. Welcome back. Any news from your name? Or is it still playing hide-and-seek? What did I just tell you? Looks like it's now right where it belongs. But I have to remind you, it is a secret. I don't want the neighbors to hear about it. Sure, sure. No secret leaves this house. Especially one about the quietest resident we've ever had here. Well, I guess that's true. For the last six months, I'm the only person who's entered my flat. By the way, I've been meaning to ask you something. I just remembered as I saw the closed doors of the movie theater. What is it? I hope you're not adding something new to my responsibilities. Why did you stop the weekly film screenings there? Because we couldn't get the money to buy a new player. Also, the neighbors aren't very sociable. It's hard to get them all together at the same time. I remember you had a collection of the best 35mm films. Let's set it up again. I love old technology. A friend of mine borrowed them and never gave them back. It ruined our friendship. Why don't you go to his house and ask for your films? Ah, I'm over it now. No time for old films. But if you want them so much, why don't you go yourself? Take this road straight up until you get to the square. His house is one of the first houses. It's got a blue door and there's a large sign hanging on its wall. Oh, you again. Well, at least you've hidden those bloody eyes of yours behind shades. Don't worry. I know everything. I know you can't sleep anymore since you saw me that night underneath your bed. And you can't tell anyone. Someone who doesn't remember her own name and sees an invisible old man will end up in the madhouse. You've trapped me. How can I get rid of this insomnia? Your sleep is tied to mine. As long as I'm awake, you're awake. But worry not, a sailor who stared into the horizon so long that her eyes have turned into the color of the sunset can endure much more than this. If it wasn't for this elephant that vanished one night from the zoo without a trace, Maybe our town's name would have never gotten into the newspapers.
There's nothing scarier in this world than a bald and blind doll. After breaking into the house, I had better not touch anything before meeting the owner. Order is the only thing you can't see in how this place is organized. The china reminds me of my grandmother's house. After breaking into the house, I had better not touch anything before meeting the owner. They must have been a rich family to have their portraits painted. Snow in a war zone. What else could go wrong? I love the feel of this painting. I'm not intruding. The door was open. I was wondering if... Of course. Come in, my dear. Ah, but of course you're not intruding. After all, we know each other. We do? Oh! Oh, yes! You own the restaurant on 20th Street! Yes, that's right. I lived a very different life back then. Did you know that I employed over 30 people in that restaurant? And I only ever met two of them? The young man I made manager, and... Me? Wow. Yeah, I remember. Actually, I remember the day I met you well. It was my 20th birthday. So it was... Five years, four months, and two days ago. Ah, uh, 25. Wonderful. I remember you didn't want to get any smarter. You still have a good memory. Intelligence was the only thing I was sure of in myself back then. I knew you were very smart from the first moment I saw you at the door holding a tray. I'd like to test you. May I? Sure. I'm curious how I'd score. It's been a while since I had to be smart. When I retired, I picked up this hobby of connecting things together and making... strange stuff. See this noisy TV? With a secret code, you can connect it to the global TV network of 100 years ago. Are you kidding? There was no TV a hundred years ago. Don't doubt an old man who's got a death ticket in his hand. TV or not, the waves are still floating in the air. Maybe you're right. Let me have a closer look at your inventions.
the china reminds me of my grandmother's house. I should probably match these in a certain way. Order is the only thing you can't see in how this place is organized. I think I can form some words from the letters on the box.
Was I falling asleep? <sighs> no. Just my eyes going blurry. Perhaps I will have to drag myself like a semi-conscious corpse through life forever. And forget the joy of sleeping. I wish I could collapse right here and no one would bother me for a few days. What if I've fallen and hit my head once and lost a part of my memory? Then why do I not forget other things? If someone asked my name right now, I might confuse everything. Miss Mizuki? Miss Mizuki? Hello? Uh, Miss Mizuki, can you hear me? Oh, sorry. I thought you were talking to someone else. Well, let's get back on topic. Can you tell me to whom Wagner wrote of his fascination with Schopenhauer and Tristan? Franz Liszt. Huh, impressive. Now tell me, Wagner's wife wrote that he remained unsatisfied with which opera? Townhouse her? Huh, how did you know? Eat one of these and you'll be full the whole day. Parsifal, an opera in three acts. Whoa, enough. I don't think I'm ready to memorize the whole history of music. I promise, if you listen to Wagner an hour a day, you won't get vertigo. Wagner gives me vertigo. By the way, starting next week, I'm going to bake leitmotif breads for my special customers. Do you know who's most specifically associated with the concept of leitmotif? I'm just going to say Wagner. He's connected to all your questions somehow. Well, you're right. You should come help me choose a name for your special bread someday. Naming the breads? Well, alright. I just hope my names don't make the breads disappear. I'll come back later sometime. I promise, if you listen to Wagner and- Wagner g- I think many people would like to have a tanuki as their town symbol. All that these cats see from up on the roof. All God's children should be able to play by the sea. Order is the only thing you can't see in how this place is organized. The china reminds me of my grandmother's house. Glad to see these things still exist in the world. I wish there was a black monster puppet too.
Didn't I see something like this around the house? They must have been a rich family to have their portraits painted. I love the feel of this. They must have been a rich family to have their portraits painted. the resident of this place has tried anything and everything to become an artist. I should take a look at those paintings in the corridor again. Snow in a war zone. What else could go wrong? I love the feel of this painting. They must have been a rich family to have their portraits painted. Oh, the threads revealed the teddy bear. Looks like I have come close to solving the dilemma. If Jack's friend made this teddy bear himself, he deserves a bravo. Why isn't his belly soft like a teddy bear's? Why isn't his belly soft like a teddy bear's? My old scissors only cut paper now. Why isn't his belly soft like a teddy bear's? I feel like there's something under the teddy bear's belly. Why isn't his belly soft like a teddy bear's? Why isn't his belly...
The solution is on the bookshelf? What should I be looking for on the bookshelf? Order is the only thing you can't see in how this place is organized. Even if it doesn't open any lock, it's still a pretty key. Come on, girl. Don't you want to see what people used to watch 100 years ago? If this wasn't about testing my own abilities, I would have given up by now. Some people get lucky and make it, but I'm not one of them. The china reminds me of my grandmother's house. I better have a closer look first. If Jack's friend made this teddy bear himself, he deserves a bravo. I wouldn't mind trying this if I found a keyhole. There's nothing scarier in this world than a bald and blind doll. Hi, Marta. Are you still looking for your cat? I can't take this anymore! How could a cat go straight up a tree and never come down? He must have come down when you weren't looking. No way! I waited under that tree for hours! I was dizzy for days I looked up at it so long! A cat can disappear in a blink of an eye. Especially male cats who forget their owners this time of year. But he'll be back. My cat wasn't like that! He'd never go more than 100 yards from here! Also... How would he get out with that dog guarding the end of the alley? I walk these streets a lot. If I see him, I'll bring him back. That would be so kind of you. I hope you find your name soon, too. I have heard a lot about your ordeal. 
Yeah, thanks. No one was supposed to know about my problem. I know who's been talking. If my name is scared of dogs like I am, it wouldn't have escaped that way. It's a dead end that way anyway. By the way, I've been meaning to ask you something. I just remembered as I saw the closed doors of the movie theater. What is it? I hope you're not adding something new to my responsibilities. Why did you stop the weekly film screenings there? Because we couldn't get the money to buy a new player. Also, the neighbors aren't very sociable. It's hard to get them all together at the same time. I remember you had a collection of the best 35mm films. Let's set it up again. I love old technology. A friend of mine borrowed them and never gave them back. It ruined our friendship. Why don't you go to his house and ask for your films? Ah, I'm over it now. No time for old films. But if you want them so much, why don't you go yourself? Take this road straight up until you get to the square. His house is one of the first houses. It's got a blue door and there's a large sign hanging on its wall. He must have a hidden clue somewhere in the building. Don't want to talk to me? Don't be scared, I live in this building. I can't talk to you because you don't have children.
am not gonna let anyone who makes that much of a racket into my home. I think he put up a poster somewhere. I totally remember the day Jack put up this poster. I even bought the text myself. Jack is always proud that his son, Arash, followed a path that he was not able to follow. last movie shown here was The Wood Elves Battle. When I was a child, this Mr. Juggalo was my favorite actor in fantasy movies. Why did Jack close up this What a photograph! So this fellow Jack was friends with the elephant in the cirque. Hey! 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 What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to stay in the inventory? Stay still! Ha <laughs> ha! 